Hi everyone. In this video, we will explore the smallest country in the world. Despite its small size, this country has a rich history and unique characteristics. So, get ready to know more about the smallest country in the world. Let's start. The smallest country in the world is the Vatican City State. Located in the center of Rome, Italy, the Vatican has an area of less than 0.5 square kilometers. Although geographically small, the Vatican has immense influence in terms of religion and culture. Roman Catholic Spiritual Center The Vatican is the spiritual center for Roman Catholics around the world. Within this small area, is Saint. Peter's Basilica, which is considered the largest church in the world. The Pope, the spiritual head of Roman Catholicism, also has an official residence in the Vatican, namely the Apostolic Palace. Independent Sovereign State. Despite its minuscule size, the Vatican is a sovereign and self-governing country. The country has an absolute monarchy system, with the Pope as the head of state who is elected by Catholic cardinals. The Vatican also has flags, currency, and official passports that are recognized by many countries in the world. Official language and population. The official languages at the Vatican are Latin and Italian. Latin is used in ecclesiastical liturgies, while Italian is used in everyday communication. Although the Vatican is very small, this country has a unique population. Since the Vatican is a holy place for Roman Catholics, the majority of the population are Vatican clergy, diplomats, and staff. The population is very small, only a few hundred people. Wonders of architecture and art. The Vatican is known for its extraordinary architectural and artistic treasures. The magnificent street, Peter's Basilica and the famous Sistine Chapel with its frescoed ceiling by Michelangelo are two stunning examples. Every year, millions of tourists come to the Vatican to see the beauty and wealth of art that is there. Cultural property. Despite its small size, the Vatican has a famous library which is called the Vatican Library. This library is one of the oldest and largest libraries in the world, with collections that include various types of literature, rare manuscripts, and ancient manuscripts. The collection includes more than 1.1 million books and 75,000 manuscripts. Apart from the library, the Vatican also has a museum which displays various collections of art and cultural artifacts. The Vatican museums are among the most famous museums in the world, with art collections that include priceless paintings, sculptures, statues and historical artifacts. One of the most famous works on display at the museum is Michelangelo's, Sistine depiction, on the ceiling of the Sistine Chapel. Existence of an independent state. Within the city one of the most interesting things about the Vatican is that it exists as an independent nation that is located entirely within the city of Rome, Italy. With a border wall separating the Vatican from Italy, this country is a unique example of how a country can exist within other geographic boundaries. Daily visitors and tourism. The Vatican receives a very large number of visitors annually. Travelers from all over the world come to visit Street, Peter's Basilica, the Sistine Chapel and its amazing museums. Due to its small size, the Vatican is often a popular short-term destination for tourists who are in Rome. Economy and income. The Vatican has a unique and unusual economy. Although the country is small, the Vatican relies on revenue from a variety of sources, including donations from Catholics around the world, sales of collectible stamps and coins, and revenue from museums and souvenir shops. This income is used to finance state operations, social missions, and cultural development. Presence of the Pope. The presence of the Pope in the Vatican is one of the main attractions. 
The Pope is the spiritual figure and supreme leader of the Roman Catholic Church. As well as presiding over Catholics, the Pope also held Mass and issued important announcements in St. Peter's Square. Many people come to the Vatican with the hope of seeing the Pope and participating in religious events organized by him. Universal Sanctuary The Vatican is considered a universal holy place by Catholics around the world. As the spiritual center of Roman Catholicism, the Vatican holds great importance as a place that symbolizes the unity, majesty and history of religions. Many people come to the Vatican with the intention of pilgrimage and are looking for a deep religious experience. Those are unique and interesting facts about the smallest country in the world, the Vatican. Despite its small size, the Vatican has a very historic and beautiful cultural heritage that is recognized worldwide. Thank you for watching this video, I hope it can provide useful information. Don't forget to share, like, comment and subscribe because your role really helps the development of this channel. Bye.